China's DF ZF Hypersonic Glide Vehicle HGV, represents a paradigm shift in missile technology. Capable of speeds exceeding Mach 5 and maneuvering unpredictably mid flight, it evades traditional radar tracking. In 2021, China stunned the world by testing a hypersonic missile that circled the globe before striking its target, a feat unmatched by any other nation. These weapons can reach U.S. bases in the Pacific within minutes, reducing response times dramatically. Their plasma stealth capability further complicates detection, rendering early warning systems nearly obsolete against such threats. The U.S. currently relies on a layered missile defense system including Aegis, SAD, and Patriot batteries. However, these systems were designed for ballistic trajectories, not hypersonic glide vehicles. During 2022 tests, THAAD achieved only a 30% interception rate against hypersonic targets. The kill vehicle struggled to adjust to HGV's sudden maneuvers during the glide phase. Satellite-based infrared sensors provide some tracking capability, but with a 10 to 15 second delay, far too slow for missiles traveling at 6,000 kilometers per hour. This vulnerability has prompted urgent calls for defense upgrades across the Pentagon. DARPA and Missile Defense Agency are racing to develop next-generation countermeasures. The Glide Phase Interceptor Program aims to destroy HGVs during their most vulnerable mid-flight phase. In 2023, Lockheed Martin demonstrated a prototype with 60% greater maneuverability than current systems. Parallel efforts include space-based interceptors and 300-kilowatt laser weapons that can disable missiles' guidance systems. The Space Development Agency plans to deploy hundreds of low-orbit satellites by 2026, creating a sensor web that reduces tracking delays to under three seconds, potentially the game-changer needed. A hypersonic arms race has created a strategic dilemma reminiscent of Cold War dynamics. While U.S. defenses may never achieve 100% interception rates, even partial success complicates China's first-strike calculus, Military analysts suggest that by 2027, improved sensors and AI-driven interceptors could raise success rates to 60 to 70 percent. However, China continues advancing its missile designs, with reports of a new fractional orbital bombardment system. This technological tug-of-war suggests that the era of guaranteed missile defense may be ending, replaced by mutual vulnerability at hypersonic speeds.